Know what fruits your dog can eat. Banana. Banana is one of the fruits that dogs can eat, but it must be given in a controlled way to avoid problems such as obesity due to its high sugar content. Fructose. It is rich in vitamins A, B6, and C, fibers, and minerals, calcium, iron, phosphorus, magnesium, and potassium. Potassium, for example, helps with muscle function and bone strength. The vitamins and minerals help to strengthen the dog's immune system. The restriction is for puppies that need to lose weight or have endocrine disorders, such as diabetes, for example. Offer moderately, peeled and cut into slices. Watermelon. For warmer days, it might be a good idea to offer your dog pieces of watermelon, as it is a very refreshing fruit due to its high water content. It is a source of vitamins A and C. Yes, dogs can eat watermelon, without the seeds and without the skin. Strawberry. Strawberry is one of the few fruits that can be offered with skin and without discarding the seeds, which later come out without problems in the poop. It has a considerable content of vitamin A, B, and C, in addition to being rich in antioxidants. The dog can eat strawberry without exaggeration as it is a fruit with many benefits for the immune system of animals and also works as an anti-inflammatory. Some animals may be sensitive to this fruit and its use should be avoided in these cases. Mango. It is also among the favorite fruits of dogs. In addition, it is a source of dietary fiber and vitamin C. The dog can eat peeled and pitted mangoes. Be very careful to avoid choking. Like bananas, caution is due to the high concentration of sugars which can harm animals that tend to gain weight. Kiwi. Kiwi is a food rich in vitamin C that can help in the digestion of food, even for dogs that have problems such as gastritis. It is also not necessary to remove the seeds, only the shell. Melon. Melon is one of the fruits with the highest amount of water. Dogs can eat melon in small pieces, without the skin and seeds. This fruit has vitamins B6 and C, fiber and potassium. Guava. It is a source of vitamins A, B, and C, and assists in the proper functioning of the dog's intestine, helping to fight diarrhea. In addition, guava is rich in iron and phosphorus. It must be offered without shell, but it is not necessary to discard the seeds. Jibuticaba. The biggest benefits of Jibuticaba are in the shell. Therefore, you can give Jibuticaba to the dog, with skin and everything but in moderation, always. In the peel of this fruit are concentrated several antioxidants, such as bioflavonoids, with action superior to that of the vitamin. In addition, it also has pectin, a type of soluble fiber that has a detox effect on the body and provides a feeling of satiety. It is rich in vitamins, C and B, and minerals, calcium, phosphorus and iron. Cashew. It is a fruit that benefits the dog's immune system in addition to being a source of vitamin C and iron. Dogs can eat cashews, as long as they are in moderation and without nuts. Pitaya. This exotic and very fashionable fruit is not toxic to dogs. To be offered to the dog, pitaya must be peeled and offered only the pulp. Because it's sweet, it may please some dogs. Yellow sign. Which fruits can be offered with caution? Pineapple. Despite being an acidic fruit, pineapple can be offered to dogs in moderation. For this, you need to peel it so as not to hurt the mouth and snout. It is rich in vitamins, A, complex B, C, and minerals, phosphorus, calcium and potassium. A differential is the enzyme bromelain, which helps with digestion. Orange. Anyone who is still in doubt whether dogs can eat oranges should keep in mind that citrus fruits are generally safe for dogs when offered in moderation. However, they are not recommended for those who have some type of fruit intolerance showing symptoms such as diarrhea or vomiting. For example, in the case of oranges, eating the peel and seeds should be avoided. The bark can still cause bruises in the animal's mouth. Litter. Apple is an example of a sweet fruit with good palatability. It is rich in vitamin C and B complex. The only restriction is that the stem and seeds are not offered, as they can release hydrocyanic acid interfering with the transfer of oxygen to the body's cells. It is a source of vitamins, A, B, C, and E, in addition to fiber. Pear. It has a flavor that is very popular with dogs and is rich in vitamins A, B, and C. In this way, the pear can be offered from time to time unpeeled but cut. But, as in the case of the apple, 
the seeds and core must be removed as it contains hydrocyanic acid. Avocado. This is a controversial fruit in dog food. That's because avocado pulp is safe to feed your dog and is high in vitamin A, despite being high in fat. At the same time, its leaves and bark contain a substance that is toxic for dogs, called persin. If ingested, the animal may have vomiting and diarrhea impairing its digestion. In addition, the lump, if ingested, can cause choking and obstruction in the stomach or intestines. Dogs with pancreatic or liver problems should avoid fatty fruits such as avocados. Papaya. This fruit can be consumed by dogs, but in moderation. It is rich in vitamins A and C, fiber, and minerals such as potassium and calcium. Papaya contains papain, an enzyme that facilitates digestion so it is famous for loosening the intestine. So keep an eye on the amount you will offer the dog. Poop. In small amounts, coconut does not cause problems for dogs, including many tutors offer the whole fruit to dogs who like to play with it. In excess, however, it can cause intestinal upset. Plum. Dogs can eat plums as long as the pit is removed. Therefore, the dog can eat prunes without pits or leaves. It is a source of fiber, vitamins, retinol, vitamin K, and beta-carotene, and minerals, potassium and iron. Khaki. The lump should not be offered to the puppy. However, the dog can eat persimmon without any problems. Now, for animals that have a tendency to form stones in the bladder, it is not recommended. Persimmon is rich in fiber, vitamin C, and E, and minerals such as phosphorus, potassium, and calcium.